I often get asked, who would fall off the platform faster, a light person or a heavy one? So I invited my pool friends from 25 to 85 kilos to test it out. We are going to try out different weight combinations from 3, 5, 7 and 10 meters. And at the end we shall see if it is possible for me to do a synchronized dive with the lightest effort of the highest platform. Watch until the end, the results really surprised us. All dives and tricks are performed by trained professionals. Don't try this at home or somewhere else. Hey, what's up, what a crew, my name is Jim. Some people would think that a heavier person will be falling slower off a tower than a lighter one. Today we are here to either prove or bust that theory, and my diving friends are here for that. Anna, 62 kilograms. Sasha, 48 kilos. Vika, 42. Masha, 41. And Igor, 26 kilograms. And my own weight is 85 kilos, so the difference between the heaviest and the lightest athletes today is almost 60 kilos. If everything goes smoothly, Igor and I will do a synchro dive of the 10 meters. Ready? Let's fly! Let's start from 3 meters. There is a common belief that springboards are much trickier than platforms in terms of synchro diving. So let's see if it is true or not. The first couple to go is going to be Anna and Yegor. The weight difference between the two of them is 36 kilos. <laughs> this is not an easy task, but as we all know, practice makes perfect. They are going to do one and a half front flip in pike position. The weight difference plays a huge role in this case, because Igor is much lighter. He cannot push the board as hard as Anna does, so he enters the water much later. But how would it look if Igor and I tried to dive together? Our weight difference is the greatest among all of the participants today. With his 26 kilos and mine 85 kilos, do we really have a chance to go to the Olympic Games? Well, I guess then you are 60 kilos heavier when you sink your partner, it is almost impossible to make the dive look acceptable. But our next stop is on the platforms, there is no spring in there, so maybe we will do a better job then. Let's check it out. Ok, we are now going to test out different synchro couples of 5, 7 and hopefully 10 meters. And the first high is 5 meters. I think Anna and Igor should try this out first, as they already tried diving together of the springboards. Get your bets on their dive now. How will it go? Perfectly. It will be average. Who do you think will enter the water first? On the wheel. Ok, let's see who guessed it right. Go, guys! On their platform dive, Anna and Igor showed something incredible. Their weight difference is 30 kilos, and compared to the springboard dive they did earlier, this one looked fantastic. I think it's time to go higher and see if 7 meters would look just as good. Ok, this is 7 meters platform and the weight difference this time is about 15 kilograms. I feel like Masha and Igor will enter the water separately, but we shall see. They are going to do one and a half flips forward. Masha and Igor had such a great synchro that the weight difference of 15 kilos did not play a role. Well, maybe you can find something on the slow more, but I think it is now the time to try out something more significant. Ok, so far we have discovered that 35 kilos difference is not important when jumping of 5 meters, and 15 kilos difference doesn't really do anything of the 7 meters platform. So I suggest we check out the 40 kilograms difference from the 7 meters, and maybe 60 kilos difference of the 10 meters right after? There is a 33 kg weight difference between Vika and I, yet it didn't stop us from making even a better dive than Masha and Yegor. I almost get a feeling that the greater the weight difference, the better our synchro goes, but the final test to prove that will be on the 10 meters with Yegor. How did we do, guys? That was awesome! I honestly could spot Vika on my side in the air, so I guess we really did good. And the 40 kilos difference in body weight did not interfere with our synchro. Let's go see if 60 kilos of 10 meters would work out the same. I think there should be a difference. Perhaps it doesn't matter when diving off a platform? If we make a solid synchro dive, it would be a record, because of how much bigger I am than Yegor. Yegor just requested front one and half tuck, not pike. Well, challenge accepted. 
самая первая оказалась Марина. A slight difference in our speeds in the air can only be spotted on the slow-mo, and we entered the water at the exact same time. So unlike in the springboard diving, on the platforms the diver's weight difference can be anything, because the air resistance at this point doesn't matter. Guys, what if Igor and I competed in an actual synchronized diving event? 10,000 likes from you and we will do it! What a crew! Today's experiment can be easily explained by physics laws. All objects will fall with the same rate of acceleration, regardless of their mass. Excluding air resistance, of course. We have covered it in detail in the other video, so make sure to watch it. Subscribe to the channel and please, don't do crazy stuff. We will do it instead of you. Take care!